Picture this, thousands of people gathered in an open field, swaying to the beats of their favorite artists. The air is electric, filled with the aroma of food trucks and the sound of laughter. Music festivals are a celebration of life, art, and community. But have you ever stopped to think about the environmental footprint left behind? The dark side of the stage, waste and pollution. Let's get real. A single music festival can generate up to 1,650 tons of waste, including plastic bottles, food wrappers, and discarded camping gear. That's equivalent to the weight of about 275 elephants. And don't forget the carbon emissions from all those people traveling to the festival. It's a sobering thought, isn't it? Green Beats, eco-friendly initiatives. But there's hope. Festivals around the world are adopting eco-friendly practices. From reusable cups to solar-powered stages, these initiatives aim to reduce the environmental impact. Some festivals even offer carbon offset options when purchasing tickets, allowing attendees to invest in renewable energy projects. The power of the crowd, your role. You're not just a spectator, you're a participant in this environmental story. Simple actions like carpooling, using reusable water bottles, and properly disposing of waste can make a significant difference. Remember, collective action starts with individual responsibility. Music festivals are a feast for the senses, but they shouldn't be a burden on Mother Earth. By being mindful of the environmental impact and taking proactive steps, both organizers and attendees can hit the right notes for a sustainable future. So the next time you're lost in the music, dancing under the stars, know that you can also be a guardian of the planet. Now that's an encore everyone can get behind. If you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe to the Science Recent channel for more eco-friendly content. Together, let's make a greener tomorrow.